Brexit. Britain will be deciding on the 23rd of June whether it wants to stay or leave the EU. What does the public think about it? I decided to ask some citizens of Vilnius this question. What effect would the UK leaving have on the EU? It's a huge effect because we are uh, we are living in the most uh, safe condition during all our history. I would say because Britain has been uh, heavy waiters in EU context for a very, very long time, uh, the impact would be absolutely felt in terms of funds and decision making. I mean, I think that obviously the impact will be huge on England itself, whether it, there's an impact on the rest of the EU, I don't really know. I think I wish Great Britain say to stay in uh, an, in European Union so other people also have the same chance as I had. And for hundreds of thousands of Lithuanians and both Polish people, that would be quite dramatic if, uh, if uh, Great Britain decided to leave the uh, European Union. If uh, they leave, uh, some country can follow them, uh, like um, uh, like maybe Hungary. With migration to England, which a lot of people have migrated there to work and contribute to the economy, many have, have moved there, of course, to take from the economy, which has caused problems within the countries. Because of how many of them live in, in, in Great Britain and work, so that could make them have to come back or make some dramatic choices. The UK is a uh... In a, an economic power and a political power in uh, UK because they participate uh, in a lot of uh, conflict resolution. Let's take a look at some facts and figures. We can start with the fact that according to the British census taken in 2013, there are an estimated 150,000 Lithuanians living in Britain. That's almost the size of the population in Clydebidon. The number grows every year. Last year, Britain paid 16.9 billion euros to the EU budget, which last year was 144 billion euros. That comes to a total of Britain paying almost 12% of the budget. With Britain gone, the amount that Lithuania and other EU nations receive from the EU will be reduced. Now let's see what the professionals think. I spoke to two political analysts to get their opinion on the matter. I think this would be a very serious blow to the EU. The EU is at the bottom of its popularity, Euroscepticism is growing, and the Euroskeptics could point to Britain as a country that would be an example for others if they were given a chance to say what they want about the European Union. So it, could be, it would be used as an argument by Euroskeptics to say that we should leave. We're not quite sure because we don't have uh, any examples of uh, countries leaving the EU, especially such an important country of the EU. Uh, of course, uh, it's a negative precedent for the EU as an organization because uh, at the moment it is shaky because of migration crisis, because of financial difficulties, because of other problems. And uh, Great Britain leaving the EU would also be a blow for the organization. And it would also probably encourage uh, other Eurosceptics from Netherlands to Hungary to say that, look, we, have, we now have an example of country leaving the EU and it did not collapse after leaving the EU. So of course it would be a negative tendency for all of the organization and, and it, its stability. What do you think the effect would be on Europe itself and Lithuania if Britain leaves? In, on Europe itself, it would be a relatively major blow because Britain is one of the military powers. The EU does have a military di dimension. It would be a blow politically because the, the England is, Great Britain is a member of the Security Council. It has a, a veto vote. Uh, it would also have a negative effect on Lithuania for two reasons. First of all, Britain is very firm against Russia. It is a proponent of, 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 of sanctions and other means to to damper down Russian aggression, and also for Lithuania, the EU is centrally important. Any weakening of the EU means a weakening of Lithuanian, the Lithuania's ability to resist various kinds of pressures. In terms of Lithuania, I think we would lose, first of all, an important ally in many cases because uh, Great Britain is very supportive uh, towards Ukraine because of what's happening now with, with Russia, with the conflict, and uh, in many cases it uh, 
it's very close in its opinion with Lithuania uh, towards the Eastern Partnership issues and etc. So it would be a blow in strategic political uh, area. On the other side, I think that Lithuania is very sensitive in terms of immigrants, uh, Lithuanians who live there. Hundreds of thousands, we're not quite sure about the exact number, but of course it would be a situation in which we're not quite sure what's their status and what their rights are in a country which is not an EU member, though it was an EU member. So those legal changes would be really difficult for many people to understand and kind of contemplate. And of course, uh, we would expect that the status of those people who are living there uh, would be uh, less uh, favorable than they are now. So of course, it's, it's a very big uh, topic for us here in Lithuania because many people live there and uh, I think that any Lithuanian has at least some relatives or friends there. So that misunderstandings that could occur uh, are obviously very sensitive. The facts have been given, the opinions have been made, but for now all we can do is sit back and watch as Britain makes one of the biggest decisions of this decade.